gonna have to give you that 60, girl. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Okay, don't judge me though. Boom. Right there. Oh! Shut the fuck. Which woman has slept with the most people? Okay. I just wanna know what the highest number is. It's like the youngest, smallest girl, and it's like 130. There are girls that it's like, oh wow, I would have thought you had more, and then ones where it's like, you'll never expect. Let's see, I think we're gonna get some interesting talking points here. What's your best stripper move? She got it. We asked women to guess which stranger I slept with the most people. Hi. Hi. Holy shit. Hey, yeah. I'm Felicia. I'm Evie. What are you doing here? I am going to be guessing how many sexual partners ladies have had. Anything that makes you qualified about that? I've had sex with a lot of people. What's your number, if you don't mind me asking? Oh my goodness, is this gonna be on camera? See, that's the thing. Oh, but because it's for, they're filming this, are you gonna be 100% truthful? Men, typically, especially when they're younger, will lie and inflate their number of partners as if to be cooler. Yeah. Like if you're a guy, a metric of how cool less you are. means, oh, you're not as cool. Yes, less yeah. means you're lame. Women, it's vice versa. What's your body count? Well, well I don't wanna put this out here because they know there's, again, the less is what they would ideally like to say when they have more they, they don't want to say it yeah because they know how the public sees yeah. people that have you know higher numbers and yeah you're labeled guys. a whore if you have a lot and then you're fucking goat if you're a guy and you have a lot and they might it doesn't matter how many people you're with but then they also won't reveal their things on yeah. camera or whatever you'll mm -hmm. get some people that don't care though either they'll be like i slept with eight them. million people yeah. well, that's all the girls on the lineup we're gonna go ahead and hand you a clipboard and you'll actually be assigning numbers today uh -oh. <laughs> okay zero sounds really depressing 17 Ooh, 60 60 Hello. how old are you too so what is your relationship with sex i am in therapy once a week and we talk about it a lot uh -oh. can zero see, can i see your best like twerk do i look like i can twerk i just want to see if that thing is thanging <laughs> Yeah. Zero. Zero. <laughs> Are you in a relationship? Mm, no. So the last five years, I've been single for four and a half. Can you like, ow? Can you give me like a little purr or a, ow? Zero. So we're putting her at the 17. I think that I'm going to assign you the number one. I don't know, therapy, like working towards being more comfortable with sex. You're not having very much. Zero to one. But she hasn't had anything, <laughs> hasn't had been in a relationship for four and a half years, so how would she, she caught 60 back then? How do you feel about your number? I feel good about it. Yeah. But I've definitely caught judgment from other people about it. Okay. She has a lot. She's probably 17. Well, right there, yeah. Uh, what kind of things turn you on? If I'm sleeping with a guy, probably more like dominance, but if I'm sleeping with a girl, more like Oh, sleeping with a girl too, okay. Even more. Interesting thing about you. Probably that I'm a stripper. You're a stripper? Mm -hmm. What's your best stripper move? Oh, so then it's even higher. I'm saying 20. <laughs> <laughs> you want me to hold you? Oh, she got it. See? You got some strength. I'm gonna give you 17. We're gonna give you nine. Hi. Hello. Uh, amazing style. I like the boobs. Thank you. <laughs> Choke or spank? I would spank. What kind of things do you do for fun? Like, do you party? Are you more of like body? I used to really be into drugs. Oh. <laughs> do you feel like your sobriety hasn't had an impact on having sex? Yeah, I make better choices. Mm -hmm. 60. A 46. There's a 46 one? Ah! Hello, how are you? Good, how are you? Were you in drama in high school? I was. Oh, okay. I feel like drama people are freaks, so. <laughs> Oh, you look like, like a dominatrix. You look like you could be one. <laughs> what is that supposed to mean? Oh. Well, okay. no, don't make her do it in the jeans. To me, those splits say that you're flexible and men like flexibility. Do you consider yourself a horny person? Yeah. How often do you masturbate? Lately, every day. But do you like the dildo or do you like the little zzz, Just these hands. <laughs> make out with your hands. Okay, that. Make out. I'm She's getting number 46. I think I'm gonna give you a nine. Why? You're confident and you're like chill, but maybe you're not that open about sex. Like slight guard. Guardedness. How old are you? I'm 25. Are you a horny gal? Yeah, some days. Do you drink? Cider is my preferred, uh, but I don't do more than three ciders in a night. Yeah, I think she's pretty. Yeah, I'm gonna say a little lower. I am going to assign you 46. I think you're a virgin. All right. 
What's your longest relationship? Uh, almost four years. How old are you? 22. You seem middle of the road to me. 10. I think that you've had sex with two people. I'm gonna have to give you that 60, girl. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Okay, don't judge me, though. I'm, no. I'm just supposed no, to judge no, you. Judge Stop the show. Watch this. I'm gonna have to give you that 60, girl. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Okay, don't judge me, though. I'm, no. I'm just supposed no, to judge no, no, you. Judge Boom. Right there. She said, I'm gonna give you the 60, girl. But don't get mad at me. <laughs> it's almost as if the woman judging knew it's an insult to have 60 bodies and assume that someone has a high body count. Why would you think that if it's socially acceptable and you could do yeah. whatever you want? Why on earth would you have any hesitation to say the number, it, the high number? Probably 60. Probably 60, but don't. How do you think that the person that actually has 60 feels about that? But I feel like if you have 60, you're probably like, yeah. Like, because if you're agreeing to come on camera, the, this 60 is probably just like, it's actually me. So that's a fair point. If I say, so I'm going to give you the 60 card here, but it's like, don't, you know, I, I don't want like, I don't want to offend you or anything. I'm just kind of making them up my own thing. So like, don't get mad at me. You're saying that you think it's a bad thing. How long have you been in a relationship? Four years. Do you masturbate a lot? Mm, not really, because I live with my boyfriend. Lower. You're a one. Mm -hmm. She said, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I have one question to ask you. What's the wettest ocean? Mine. Nine. Here you go. <laughs> Are you a party girl? I am. I like drinking. <laughs> I love dancing. Oh, shit. Do you masturbate? No. I don't feel like I need to. So we're going to give you two. Okay. Don't need to. I can you just hit him up. I'm going to give you zero for now. It's the only number I have left. You're not the virgin here. Okay. I am going to give you the last number that I have, which is 60, even though I don't think that's your number. Let me make some guesses here. The virgin? I'm sticking with my first choice. Green top? First yeah. green top. And the most? Oh, I got a couple options for that one. The most, I'm leaning towards red skirt. I'm leaning towards stripper with the big tall boots. Maybe they're trying to throw us off with the young one. Oh. The young Asian one I'm thinking is lower. I feel like the stripper is throwing us off too. They just want you to think because I'm a stripper, she has to have the most. But she said she was judged. That's why I think she's a 46. Orange hair or purple could be 60. Purple Air Maxes could be high up there. They're just like tricking me right now. Like you wouldn't think I could, but oh, I'd be out there. I think I'm gonna switch zero and 28. Don't ask me why. Can I please have your numbers? Thank you. I'm gonna give you the 60. Okay. Raise your hand if Felicia guessed you correctly. Turn around. I believe it. Oh. <laughs> Shut up! Warren, I saw that. And they switched the numbers yep. to show me? Go ahead and look at me. Oh, I want to know so bad who got that high one. What would your sign say? We could put like three question marks. Oh! Yes. Look at the 60. Oh shit. The one that we didn't expect I'll, anything. I'll keep it a sec. I've seen girls that were not conventionally attractive, that looked a certain way, that had crazy bodies. Even looks isn't a good determinant. Okay. I would judge looks a high key. Okay. If you're an okay. ugly guy, it is very likely you have very little body. If you're a handsome guy, it's very likely that you have far more than an ugly guy. Girls, it's, there's no... There's no way to tell. There's no way to tell. So she's going to therapy because she does it too much. Question marks for three digits? Yeah, I was alcoholic, and so a lot of it I'd made really bad choices. She has three digits? But I actually, literally on my way here, I was like, it's gonna be the one you don't think. How do you feel about that? <laughs> so, claimed my sexuality and learned what I liked and became confident. If you're gonna offer to feed me, I'm gonna eat. Hey now! I was thinking that, but then I was thinking like, do I really wanna pin that number just because you're a stripper? Are you surprised by it? I'm not, actually. As long as everybody's consenting and safe, like I think that sex should be shared and everyone should get a slice of pizza, you know? So, 17. Yeah, you know. Do you wish that you were retired? <laughs> I was just trying to prove that men would wanna fuck me, and they did. Whoa. But then I was like, two! Too. I thought you would have been the 60. What do you think number number three is gonna come along? Probably not anytime soon. I don't find sex interesting if I'm not like invested in somebody. How old are you? 25. Oh, what are you waiting for? Not saving myself for marriage or anything. Waiting for it to happen, but it hasn't yet. What do you think about that? I think that she has a very loyal toy at home. <laughs> come on up. See, I, I, I knew this one. I knew this one. So cute. One, 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 one. One, what did I give you? 
60. <laughs> oh, I think it'd be 60. Oh, I was like, you the hoe. You can't say that if you're a guy. It's that you if you have 60 bodies, you're a, you're a hoe. So when everybody laughs at that, they're like agreeing. <laughs> like, uh -huh. Yeah, that's true. Yeah, because somebody has 60 that's standing right behind you. Put a man in these positions guessing who, with girls, how many have. You know they couldn't bodies. do that, though. Yeah, then you know they can only put women on this thing. But even then, you're shaming the woman. You said she's a hoe. So now you're saying she looks like a hoe. What does that even mean? Same. I'm like really attractive. Is that a compliment? That's the thing. People try to tiptoe and want this whatever, what's it called? Um, a utopian society of no one judges anyone and everything's perfect and no one say anything. Whereas this is you're judging people's looks, how promiscuous they are, which people do that every day quietly to themselves. But when you say it out loud, that's when it starts to be like an interesting video. So in your relationship though, like is sex a big part of it? It's been at a little low, but right before that it was like nonstop. How do you feel about your number? What? It was just all in like a very short span of time. Okay. <laughs> so I was seeking male validation. Yeah. And it all sucked. And do you feel, I mean, so it's like slowed down <laughs> since? Yeah. Okay. I feel like I had that early on in my sex mm -hmm. career. And then you like don't talk about it. Right. So are you having more fulfilling sex now? Good. Yeah, I would have waited if I would have known that. Yeah, it could totally. Be good. I think we all have a few on the list we'd <laughs> like yeah. to kick off. Yeah. yeah. She felt like uncomfortable talking about that. That happened, and the red hair girl also said the same thing. I was seeking the male. I wanted just to prove that I could have it. Validation, whatever. So, are you insinuating that lower is better? She said, I wish I would have known that it could have been really good with just one person, so I would have preferred to not have gone through. Yeah, rather, we're, j we're just supposed to add up the bodies and that's <laughs> it. And then the other girl was like, you know, you gotta get a couple of the lists. You're like, oh, shouldn't have done that. Shouldn't have. It's looked at as bad. They're all saying it, but not overtly. They're covertly saying it by, you know, um, if I could have had less than I would have. 28. Enlighten me. <laughs> 28. I've slept with 13 men. You know, I was keeping track. I have like a note on my phone with the names, but hooking up with women for me wasn't like adding to my body count. Okay. But it is. A lot of people are surprised because I'm kind of like risky and wild. I've been super closeted for like 10 years. Does your family know? No. Oh my, my gosh. My sister does. Okay. Yeah. Are you out now though? I mean, obviously you just said no. it on camera. Okay, well, <laughs> now happy Pride Month. Sure. How many people do you think Edie has left? Oh no. 13. Y'all yeah, mind your business. 10. Who guessed 10? She is the closest. Number nine is the closest. I don't feel like women's pleasure is talked about and celebrated in a way that it should be, especially young women. It's like we're taught that something's being taken from us as opposed to it being two people participating in something together. That's a fair take. She had good takes the whole video. That's a good take. Yeah. Let's see the comments. The one girl said, you're 25, what are you waiting for? That comment is so, uh, why does she have to be waiting for something? Seems like she's a really fun person. She doesn't need to have sex to have fun. All power to her. Yeah, so like when you're 25 as a girl, it's like, why haven't you done it? Same with a guy, whoa, what are you, it's not even what are you waiting for, it's like you're, a loser. Wanted, nope, wanted, you're a loser. Yeah. Whereas the girl, it's what are you waiting for? Because you can do it yeah, whatever you yeah. want. Why do people categorize being a virgin? And no drinking and smoking as boring. People have fun without doing all those three things. I agree. The people that, that do like, those things say that that's boring because they don't know correct, how to have correct, fun correct. without correct. doing like, those things. I they only have fun with that. Yeah. Stuff. I was seeking male validation and it all sucked. Seems to be the theme here. This video reflects the issue of shaming women who haven't had sex or as many partners. Some people truly don't desire sex the way other people do. Some people have sexual trauma. Some people simply just don't care to add to the number. It's sad to see these women painted as boring or waiting for something. The time will come when they're ready to and can explore that. But it was women putting those judgments on other women. What are you waiting for? Oh, this and that. You see the woman shaming the woman for nobodies, making judgment. Oh, I'm sorry, and if I give you the 60. They shamed them both ways. And it was women doing that. Does that mean that the women are misogynists for shaming the women with more bodies? They should have had somebody, you know how you know some cultures you can't have sex until you're a certain age or mm -hmm. whatever until you get married um it would have been interesting to maybe have someone like that up there have their takes bottom line is you never know you never know you never and know. motherfuckers lie every day even if they tell you two it could be 200. yeah we don't know if 60 if people asked her body count she's at 55. well what do you have 60 could be at 260. yeah because they just responded to the email from the producer like how many bodies do you have okay so i have 45 but for the cut video six i'm actually at eight but I'll put 46 because I don't know who the highest is. I could never trust anyone saying their body count. And if this is just what they told them, we don't know. You're incentivized to lie. You're going on cut with 11 million mm -hmm. subscribers. All right, uh, rank us down below. Rank us below.